Hello. As I walk into the doors of Girls Sink in the heart of downtown Oakland, I am greeted by, by warm, smiling staff. These women know me. They are invested in me. This is my community. Leaving Girl Sync, I pass City Hall. These are the halls of power I will influence one day to advocate for, for equality and opportunity for those in need. Hello, my name is Nelsie. I am a Girl Sync National Scholar from Alameda County, and I am an activist. <laughs> Growing up in East Oakland, we moved around a lot not always sure where we live next. Walking outside at night, it was common to hear gunshots, police, sirens, and ambulances. My brother and I, as the children of two Mexican immigrants, never knew if our parents would be here one day or gone the next. It was hard to feel safe or secure. Girl Sync started out as a safe place to hang out with my friends and escape the streets. But as I got older, Girl Sync became the place that helped me through the challenges I faced. I've struggled to be healthy and battled with low self-esteem all my life. I didn't think I was beautiful. I felt awkwardly tall and bigger than everyone else. I felt like no one wanted to be around me. But at Girl Sync, I learned that beauty is defined by confidence and self-love not by how closely you resemble the woman on TV or magazines. <laughs> With the support of my mentors and my Girl Sing sisters, I overcame the days of self-hatred to become a girl who champions being strong, both mentally and physically. In the 10th grade, I learned about food deserts and the lack of accessible grocery stores and fresh produce in Oakland, and why so many poor people of color were unhealthy. I knew I had to do something. At the time, I was doing an internship with the local TV station and decided to create a documentary to highlight these issues. I had no idea how to conduct proper research, <laughs> interview people, or even work a camera, but, as, but I learned, and it was a success. The documentary was featured on PBS NewsHour and won the National Academy of Television and Arts and Sciences Award. Yes, I could tell you a sad story about growing up a poor brown girl in the fifth most dangerous city in the country, but that is not what I want you to remember about me. <laughs> remember that. The most important thing about me is not that I have struggled, it is that I have overcome challenges and will make an impact in this world. I am committed to help shed lights on important issues of inequality to create a better and more just society for all girls. Today, I am a freshman at UC Berkeley and plan to study... <laughs> I know, I was so proud. I was actually in the car when I saw my acceptance letter, it was great. Uh, <laughs> I plan to study film and American studies. Uh, my dream would be to go to film school one day. And my goal is to do something I'm passionate about uh, so I can take care of myself and my family. Uh, 